Carefully unpack the contents of the Galileo Scope box. You should have two long half cylinders. You will find the large glass objective lens inside foam to protect it during transit. Carefully remove the lens. If you look closely, you'll see that it's two lenses glued together. One lens is thin. You put that facing outward. The Galileo scope can be mounted on a tripod using the included nut. The nut is inserted into a slot on the bottom of the telescope. Be sure to insert one of the points straight down. Take the two halves of the focuser and put them together. And we'll put the elastic ring over the end. and then put the end cap over the focuser. This will help hold the telescope together. And then the other elastic ring. We'll place that in our telescope body. And then we put the top on. It just snaps into place like this. Secure the two halves together with the small telescope cap on one end and put the elastic ring over the top, which fits into a groove about halfway down. This will help hold it together. Then you can put your large cap on. And for extra measure, another elastic ring on the other side. And there you have the body of the telescope. Now let's set this aside on the nifty little wedges. And we'll get out the parts to make our eyepieces. The small lenses are in the same foam as the big lens. Our first eyepiece lens we're going to make is called the Keplerian. And altogether you have six little lenses. So for this one you'll need the four largest lenses. Two are flat on one side and curved inward on the other side. Place the lenses together. Insert each of the eyepiece lenses you assembled into the slots. Insert the small, thin ring, the field stop, into the front of the eyepiece. Be sure that the flat sides point away from each other. Secure the top half of the eyepiece assembly to the bottom half with the rings on each end. And there you go. Next we'll make the Galilean eyepiece. And it has the two smaller lenses. But for this one, you'll want to make sure the flat side points toward the bigger end of the eyepiece. You put the top on, it's held together 
with a small black ring. And then the other piece goes right on there. Remove the Keplerian eyepiece and replace it with the Galilean. With a simple modification, you can make a 2 times Barlow lens. Take the Galilean eyepiece out of the telescope and remove the cap. Insert the Galilean eyepiece in the narrow end of the Barlow tube. Insert the Kepler eyepiece into the wide end of the Barlow tube. Insert the Barlow assembly into the focuser, and there you go. If you have any more questions, feel free to visit our site, www.teachingwithtelescopes.org.